how we can parameterize a, a flat file name and file path in Informatica Power Center. I created a workflow and I want to parameterize the target uh, file name and the file path. To do that, first we need to define a workflow variable for that. First go to uh, workflow, edit and variables. Here you can define two variables, one for uh, the target file directory and another for target file name. Both can be a data type of string. Once you define the workflow variable, then you can uh, go to the session task, the mapping task, go to mapping, select the target which you want to parameterize. And if you see the property, you can see uh, output file directory and output file name. You can assign both the workflow variable which you created uh, corresponding to the directory and the file name. This is how you are assigning the workflow variable to the uh, directory and file name in the target. So that's it. The last step you need to do, you need to uh, give the location for your parameter file. For that, go to workflow uh, properties. Here you can see parameter file name. This is the location uh, in which the integration service can get the parameter file. So this I defined in the workflow level because I'm using a workflow parameter file. The same thing you can do in the session level as well. If you go to the uh, mapping session task, uh, properties here also you can see parameter file name if you give the uh, parameter file here it will be in the session level so both the th both the way you can do that so this is how we are uh, parameterizing a uh, flight file object and if you run this workflow oh, one second the final thing is like if you need to create a parameter file so this is the sample parameter file i mentioned the folder name workflow name session name and this is the two field which i am passing from the parameter file this is the target directory and this is the target file name so the integration service will read the parameter file pass this value to the workflow and it will get assigned to the session task now let's uh, run this workflow and see how the output looks like and my mapping uh, the workflow is running and it is completed fine i am just reviewing the session log if you see the session log, you can see the target file is getting mapped from the uh, parameter file ffemployee.txt and this is the uh, target directory that is also getting the value from the parameter file. So that means the indication service could able to find the parameter file in the given location and it uh, parts the value, the target directory and the file name from the parameter file and used in the mapping. And uh, if you see the target location, you can see the file code successfully generated in the target directory. Okay, that's it. Uh, hope this helped. If you have any question, please get back to me. Thank you.